So a couple of years back, I made a video showing off my video game collection, which I had just started at the time. And that is when I said this. Uh, maybe I'll make this a yearly tradition. Yearly tradition. Yearly tradition. Yeah, that aged poorly. Honestly, my reason for not making this video sooner is just simply that I wanted to have a decent increase of games in my collection before showing it again. Just so this wasn't just basically the same video again. Now you may be wondering, why haven't I been buying as many games as much? And to put it simply... <coughs> well, without further ado, let's jump right into the updated collection. So here's the gaming shelf updated. It, well, there's still some comics on here. Uh, the shelf is clearly more full than it was in the original video. By a little bit. Especially in the Switch collection. But anyway, uh, let's get started with the uh, libraries. So even though some of these are the same, just in case no one watched the original video, I'm still going to briefly go through all the games again. Alright, so just starting with my few PS2 games. I have uh, NHL 02, uh, Spider-Man Friend or Foe, and Spider-Man Web of Shadows. So, I don't know how many PS2 games. Now, I haven't actually added to the Wii collection, so just to run through them real quick. Donkey Kong Country Returns, Epic Mickey 1, Epic Mickey 2, uh, Greg Hastings Paintball, still the worst shooter I've ever played, uh, Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, uh, I go Batman, I go Indiana Jones 2, I go Pirates of the Caribbean, I go Star Wars 3, Mario Kart Wii, Mario Kart Sports Mix, Still my favorite sport game, probably. Mario Super Sluggers. Metroid Prime 3. Mario Kart Wii. I mean, <laughs> New Super Mario Bros. Wii. Uh, Scooby-Doo First Fright. Super Mario Galaxy. The original Skylanders Trilogy. These are all games. Now, 360's only had one new edition. However, I'll still be running through all of them. Uh, we got... Halo 4, Disney Infinity 1 and 2, Lego Marvel, Madden, uh, the classic of the classics, Minecraft Xbox 360, those are the days. The last one will be that 2K made, a couple NHLs. Uh, the new edition is here with Persona 4 Arena. This game's not very good. I've heard Alex Max is a lot better. I've been meaning to get it on newer systems, but they do not make a physical, unfortunately, except for in Japan, so I'd have to get that imported on my Switch. Uh, and then I got uh, PVZ Garden Warfare. Great game. Now, there's been a couple additions to the Xbox One library. Uh, Conan Exiles. This game's not really my thing. Uh, I just kind of have it. Dead by Daylight. Halo, the Master Chief Collection, I have actually now played every game on it, and I will say, hot take, Reach is the best one. Don't know how hot of a take that is, though, anymore. We got Jump Force. Um, this game's awful, but I found it for 10 bucks, so that's a win. We got Tekken 7. Now, my PlayStation 4 and 5 collection has been expanded to being a couple shelves, so just to run through these games, because there's been... Quite the few additions here. We have 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. It's a decent story game by Atlas and Vanillaware. Uh, Batman Arkham, the first two games. Modern Warfare. Another copy of Dead by Daylight because I play it on PlayStation more now. Crash Bandicoot, Insane Trilogy. Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I actually liked Dragon Ball when it was Dragon Ball Z. So this was a fun pickup, pretty fun game. What well, is an amazing, but it's a very solid title. Skyrim. Um, I know a lot of people really like Skyrim. I think it's a solid game, but it's just not so much for me. It's still, a, I still enjoyed the like 13 hours I put into it though, for the most part. Um, Final Fantasy VII Remake, uh, the box kind of shoved in there. Uh, my hot take, another gaming hot take, uh, Final Fantasy XV. I actually think this is one of the better Final Fantasies. I really liked it. I know a lot of people didn't, but I really enjoyed it. Uh, 
Five Nights at Freddy's Help Wanted. Uh, probably the best Five Nights at Freddy's game. Uh, God of War. Cannot wait for Ragnarok at the end of the year. Horizon Zero Dawn. One of my favorite fighting games ever, Injustice 2. Kingdom Hearts, the entire collection, still still haven't picked up Melody of Memory on PlayStation. We'll probably eventually do that, just haven't been in a rush since I have it on the Switch. Last of Us, still haven't bought the second one physically. Lego Dimensions, Lego Harry Potter collection, like a Marvel collection, a couple Maddens. Mega Man 11, which I didn't say this in the last uh, collection video. But I found this game for five bucks at a Target, so that was a fun pickup. Couple MLB games. Uh, the Secret Gem of Square Enix, Neo The World Ends of View. I thought this was a fantastic game, and I highly recommend it to anybody who wants to try this kind of a game. It's a sort of action RPG where you control four characters at once. It's really cool. Persona 5, two copies of that. Persona 5 Royal, still my favorite game of all time. This game is incredible. And I highly recommend that you check this game out when it comes to Switch or Xbox if you haven't played it on PS4. Oh, and it's coming to PC too. Uh, the Persona Dancing Games, they're okay. PVZ Garden Warfare 2. Red Dead Redemption 2, such a good game. Resident Evil 2 Remake. This is now probably my favorite horror game after replaying it. Resident Evil 4 is a close second though. Also have the golden edition of Resident Evil 7. Bought this when they did the uh, PS5 upgrades. Game looks really nice on PS5. Risk of Rain 2. This also has Risk of Rain 1 in it. Played this for a little bit. Fun 5 below pickup. Spider-Man. Spyro. Uh, my couple copies of Street Fighter 5. Battlefronts 1 and 2 by EA. Still sad what happened to Battlefront 2. Jedi Fallen Order. The entire Uncharted collection. Recently replayed uh, Uncharted 4 when they did the PS5 upgrade uh, for 10 bucks. A little hesitant spending that money just to upgrade my game at first, but it was honestly worth it just to re-experience that game again with uh, better visuals and frame rate. Uh, Until Dawn. Still a great game by uh, Supermassive. Yakuza 0 is what I've been playing recently, and while I didn't like this game as much when I first played it, I'm liking it a lot now. COD Cold War. Yikes. Oh yeah, we're moving on to PS5 here. Uh, we got Demon Souls. Still never finished this game. Elden Ring. Really like this game a lot more than I thought I would, though I have not finished it yet. I have played like 30 plus hours, though. It's a great game. Uh, Guilty Gear Strive, a really cool fighting game. Another fighting game I've really liked recently, uh, King of Fighters 15. This is a really good fighter by SNK. Um, Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate. The game I, probably the most, the newest game in my collection, The Quarry. Uh, this is definitely, uh, Super Massive's best game since Until Dawn. Uh, what I would say is probably my favorite PS5 game so far, Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart. This game's really cool. Resident Evil Village, very solid game. And uh, Spider-Man Miles Morales to end off the PlayStation games. Now moving on to Switch, the console that probably has the most new entries. Starting off, we have Bendy and the Ink Machine. Uh, Danganronpa Decadence. I haven't played these games too much on the Switch because I played them on my PC back in the day, but still glad to have a physical and uh you know have them on the go now doki doki literature club plus very solid visual novel uh yeah this looks good. dragon quest 11 final fantasy 12 the zodiac age uh fire Emblem three houses still haven't gotten three hopes yet the core collection of five nights at freddy's age of calamity i still don't like that game <laughs> Uh, Kirby and the Forgotten Land. I just finished this recently. What a great game. Definitely my favorite Kirby now. On the contrary, Star Allies. My least favorite Kirby game. Uh, Kingdom Hearts Melody of Memory. Uh, Breath of the Wild. What can be said about it again? Link's Awakening. Still one of my favorite Zeldas. I know a lot of people didn't enjoy it as much, but I really liked it. 
Uh, Skyward Sword HD, another one of my favorite Zelda's that I know a lot of people don't like as much. We just mentioned three. Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Metroid Dread. This was such a phenomenal game. Couldn't recommend it enough. Monster Hunter Rise. Nino Kuni. Uh, the first two Ori games. Well, the only two Ori games. Persona 5 Strikers. I also have the steel book of that. Pokemon Legends Arceus. This was definitely my favorite Pokemon game in a long time. And on the contrary, here's Let's Go Pikachu. Ring Fit, because gains. I didn't like it. <laughs> Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. The game. So glad to have this physically. Especially since it was gone to history for a while there. Shin Megami Tensei 3. Shin Megami Tensei 5. My favorite love-hate relationship in video games. Uh, Star Wars, uh, J Jedi games, the old classic ones. Uh, I have Racer and Republic Commando. Stranger Things 3, the game. Just off topic, Stranger Things Season 4 was amazing. Uh, 3D All-Stars. 3D Warpus Bowser's Fury. Like this game a lot more than I thought I would. Mario Maker 2. Super Mario, Mario Odyssey. Smash Ultimate, still one of the best games ever made. To the Moon. Triangle Strategy. Undertale. World of Goo. And Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Now, my handheld games have had the least new entries, so I'm just going to rapid fire through them. Only GBA game. Chain of Memories. Now on the DS. Corvette game. Go Diego Go. Uh, How to Train Your Dragon. Ice Age. Incredible uh, game. Kingdom Hearts recoded. Lego Batman. Lego Ninjago. Lego Harry Potter. Lego Indiana Jones. Other Lego Indiana Jones. Lego Star Wars 3. Other Lego Star Wars. Still the first game. Uh, best Mario RPG. Baseball. Uh, New Super Mario Bros. Phoenix and Ferb. Rudolph. Scribble Nuts. Star Wars Clone Wars. Superhero Squad. Mario 64 DS, Thor, which is the way to replace, Angry Birds, more Angry Birds, Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, Batman, Lego City, Harry Potter, Ninjago, the only new uh, entry on my handhelds, other Lego Ninjago, Lego Movie, Mario, uh, 3D Land, and Persona Q2. So I hope you guys enjoyed checking out my updated collection. I know my OCD appreciated realizing that Kingdom Hearts was out of place while I was editing. Anyways, that's all for now. I got more content on the way and I hope you guys will stick around for it. That's all for now. See you around.